brought to you by the word laissez-faire. Okay, so David, our student body. Senior class. Senior class. Senior class vice president. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you the word of the day and you're gonna tell me what you think it means, okay, David? Because he tried to cheat before we started this. Okay, so what do you think laissez-faire means? Laissez-faire. Um, laissez-faire means a fair of laziness. That's really close. Are you, are you serious? Yeah, I'm really serious. It's, it's having a whatever happens, happens attitude. So you're, <laughs> so you're right. I, I got it. So he got it. Laissez-faire, having a whatever happens, happens attitude. Oh, great. Good morning, Lancers. Welcome to GTV. These are your morning announcements for Wednesday, October 7, 2015. I hope you had a good Monday and Tuesday. I'm Emily. And I hope you have a great Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, because I'm Leslie. <laughs> As you know, this episode of GTV is brought to you in part by the word laissez-faire. If you were paying attention, which you should have, you now know what that means. So students, use that to your advantage and impress your teachers today by asking them to have more of a laissez-faire attitude with your grades. That tip was free. The next one will cost you $10, because I'm poor. <laughs> Please stand for the pledge. I pledge, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Today we have a commercial from the Drama Council. Roll the videos. Hello and welcome to Granger Drama Halloween Costume Contest. Yo, dog, that was dope. What are you, an elf? That was so beautiful. Ten. Yo, dog, that was awesome. That's a horrible costume. I love Luigi. Nothing against your costume. I, I just hate you. Negative 11. Come to our next social October 14th. If you want to be a part of the costume contest, be there at 5.30. If you want to see Little Shops of Horrors, be there at 6 o'clock. There is a host of fun run on Wednesday, October 7th after School for Cancer. You can pledge money for the members who are walking or running in the five miles. All proceeds will go to the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society, guys. It's such a good cause, so pledge. Attention Scholar Pathway students. There is a meeting after school today at 2.30 in the lecture hall. We will meet briefly together and then separate in class levels for individual instructions. There will be cinnamon rolls and milk, so come enjoy and get started on preparation for college. I would just go for the cinnamon rolls. Yeah. Cinnamon. <laughs> Attention 11th graders. On October 14th, you will have the opportunity to take a test called the PSAT. By taking the PSAT, you will get practice for the SAT test and be able to connect to scholarships. After the test, you will be able to receive feedback on your readiness for college, as well as tools to help you improve. This is a great opportunity, guys, so don't let it pass by. Please sign up at the Counseling Center if you have any questions. Ask Mrs. Takashima. You'll also need to pay $10 to Mrs. Foster at the payment window at the main office. Or if you want to give them to me, that's fine. <laughs> that's it for GTV. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter at GrangerHS. And hashtag your GTV jams and your G-House fix, guys. So, have a great day. Wingapo. If what? you didn't like today's episode, <laughs> blame Clay Beer. 
He had a laissez-faire attitude towards the school's production. You can go blame him. J108, guys. Swing on by.